It's story time. It's story time. Es hora de el cuento. It's story time. It's story time. Es hora de el cuento. Hi, welcome to Craft Day. I'm Miss Garris. And I'm Miss Beth. On Monday, we read the book, I Talk Like a River. If you missed the book and you would like to hear the story again, please click on the hashtag in the description. Okay, today we are going to be making a fish aquarium craft. You will need two paper plates, blue paint, a paintbrush, plastic wrap, anything you can find to make an ocean scene, scissors, glue, stapler, and tape. First, cut the middle out of one paper plate, then paint the bottom of that plate and the top side of the other plate. While they are drying, make your fish. After the paint has dried, assemble your aquarium any way you like. Cut the plastic wrap and tape it to the unpainted side of the plate. Then staple the plates together, and there you have a beautiful fish aquarium. Next we're going to be making an edible aquarium. Look at our happy crab. Doesn't he look so happy? To make this, you will need a blue paper plate, some cheese string, this is the top of celery, this is a cherry tomato, this is a strip from cucumber, this is a red pepper, a piece of bread, some uh, goldfish crackers, and some trail mix to give it some color. Okay, so we're gonna start at the top. So we need how many goldfish? Let's do four goldfish. Next, we'll use the top of the celery to be seaweed. Right, now we're going to make a starfish out of the bread. So you just find a, a star cookie cutter and press it down. Okay, the body of our happy crab is a section from the red pepper. Now, Miss Karis is using a very sharp knife, so make sure that you get an adult to help you because uh, we don't want anybody to get cut. Okay, so that looks like the body of a crab. To make his happy smile, we're going to use a piece of the um, cheese stick. Make a happy smile. Okay, to make the section of his, his legs, we need um, a piece of the red pepper cut in strips. Now for his claws, we're gonna take the cherry tomato and all we do is cut that in half and then make a triangle out of the middle. Save that piece of the triangle because that's going to be his eyes.
Now for his eyes, we, we need a section of the red pepper also. Just a strip. And then the piece of the cherry tomatoes. dot from the cheese on top of that. Now a little piece of a raisin would make the pupils of his eye. Our happy crap coming to life. Okay, now we need some trail mix at the bottom. That would represent the pebbles of the ocean. And then our last piece would be the cucumber. Would be some more seagrass in the ocean. It looks yummy to me. Enjoy. I hope you enjoyed our craft ideas today. Join us here tomorrow at 10.30 a.m. for some fun with science. Goodbye. Goodbye.